Oh yeah, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to upload your video directly to YouTube without even having to save it on your drive, guys. You can go straight from Premiere Pro to YouTube. Don't even need to keep a copy. But anyways, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Now, you guys know this video is serious and it's very, very clear it's serious because I've got the money pig. Yep. I got this as a free download of Pixabay, guys, but again, it's the piggy bank money pig. So, yeah, it's about to get hectic. All right, guys, the first thing you want to do, if you want to follow along with me, you want to get some footage and just drop it into your project like I have done here. Next, drop it into your timeline. And bingo, bango, we got ourselves a little sequence. Now, we'll just scroll through it, and yeah, the money pig. Yeah, you guys are like, yeah, what's up? Um, it's only about, like, what, 20 seconds long, so... Anyways, guys, the next step in order to, to upload directly to YouTube is nice and simple. You want to go up to File, and there's two ways to do it, I believe, but let's go ahead and let's just do it the nice, easy way. File, Export Media, click Media like that. Now, here we go. Now, normally, you know, you, you go H.264, that's, the, that's what most people use, and you match the sequence settings just like this. But now there is a new little tabby over down here, and it's called Publish. And this is beautiful. Um, I will state very quickly, though, there is way more things you can do than just upload directly to YouTube. There are multiple uh, other sites and, and, and directories, but we're going to focus on YouTube in this one. Now, you want to be careful here. You want to grab the little uh, scrolly bar thingy down and drag it and drop it. Now, they've done this alphabetically. Adobe Creative Cloud, which is actually quite useful, Adobe Stock, Behance, these are all separate accounts or separate, um, yeah, basically separate accounts and places where you can upload your video direct. Facebook, extremely important, we'll go over that another time, but if you go right down pretty much to the bottom, yep, it's YouTube. Now you want to click the check mark on this bad boy, and then you want to click login, obviously. Let's go ahead and log in. We're going to authorize the application. I have already authorized it, but if you haven't authorized it, like you would not have, you would just want to go ahead and click Add Account. Uh, I could even walk you through the account process. So you would just, uh, no, let's not even do that. Um, you would just add in, like, I don't know, do I have another account? Sure, dpi38 at gmail.com. And then I would type in my password. Hope I know it. Uh, no, okay, forget, eh, cancel that. I did remember it. There we go. And here we go. We can go ahead and upload directly to one of these three accounts. Now I'm just going to drop out of that and skip that, but I'm going to go ahead and click login. And here we go. I'm just going to collect these notes because that's where I'm uploading to. Another thing here, while I got you, you can upload to have, you can, pardon me, you can have multiple accounts. So if you're, you know, a, a content marketer and you work for a business and you've got like, you know, you've got a you got a sales account, you got a product account, you've got a, like 10 different accounts or your social media manager, you can have all those accounts lined up and ready to go. Anyways, that little side, let's keep going. We'll click on allow. Boom. Now we're uploading directly to these notes. Now I currently don't have any playlists, although I'm going to go through them and, and sort them out in the, in the Premiere Pro, After Effects, Illustrator, all that stuff. But right now I don't. But if you did, they would show up here, and that is awesome. Now, this this here is the title, the description. This is basically like it's just it's like you're just logging right into YouTube, and you're just skipping that step. So I just call this uh, how to upload. Okay, uh, upload directly. Yeah, let's see. yeah. What do you want to call it? You want to go with that directly to to YouTube with Adobe Premiere. Pro CC 2018. And here is a quick tutorial on how to upload directly to YouTube using Adobe Premiere. Oops, can't spell Curtis CC 2018. Done. Privacy, I want to make this public. And do I want to use tag? Sure. Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2018 YouTube. Uh, whatever. Um, if you want to add in more guys how to upload, just separate them with commas as it says there. Upload 
directly to YouTube from Premiere Pro. I will go ahead and add in a whole bunch of other things later on, but right now this is just to prove the point. Custom thumbnail, I'm just going to use frame from source video, but you can upload your cup. You can actually look at this. I'm going to use the thumbnail at zero zero seconds, but if I want to use like something else, you can just scroll through and take from that second. And if you want to verify what second or what you're getting, like we could take, okay, the money pig. We want the money pig looking at us. We want the money pig looking at us. This is as good as, as I think it's going to get, guys, but you can select a direct frame, which is another amazing feature. And the last one, guys, while I got you here, is you can delete the local file after upload. So what does that mean? If you click that check mark, there will be no file on your computer. Theoretically, you don't even need a hard drive almost. You just go from computer to YouTube. <laughs> Premiere Pro to YouTube, and you don't have to store it. But anyways, I don't want to do that. I want the local file. Now, the other thing you can do here, the last thing I will talk to you guys about in this one here is queuing up. If you guys, you can queue or export, pardon me, but if you have like a hundred videos that you got to upload and you don't have time to sit there like a knob and just upload, 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 you can hit the queue button here and it will go directly to YouTube and it will allow you to upload multiple videos up in a batch. I'm just going to click the standard export here um, and off we go, guys. This is exactly how it's done. Maybe I'll even switch over and see it uh, while I got you here. I'm logged in on my Safari browser. Um, just to show you that it works, because it's uh, it's kind of magical, and it's a beautiful new feature. So, new feature, pardon me. So, all right, come on, come on, come on. We're encoding Piggy. <laughs> Piggy, one, two, nine, two, two. Yeah, guys, I got the money pig going up. You know what's up. And there goes the upload. And it's nice and slow, because I got other stuff uploading at the same time. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it, it calculates your upload speed here, too. Again, guys, an amazing new feature in, Pro, in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2018. This... They, they really did it. Between this and the text, the, you know, the new text, um, or the new, yeah, the new type um, feature that I, I did in a previous video, it's got some pretty wild stuff going on here. So anyways, that's the end of this. And up she goes. Now, we should be able to see in my other browser, as soon as this is done, it will, I'll, I'll quickly click on Creator Studio. And look at that, guys. It is right there. How to directly upload with YouTube with Adobe Premiere Pro. I did not log into YouTube. I did not click this button here. Magic, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Of course, leave any requests, any questions, anything you want to learn that you need help with. I'm here to help, guys. Just leave a comment. Subscribe to my channel if you like this kind of thing. And uh, I will make a video for you showing you how to do all of these different techniques. That's what I do. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll be back soon with some more videos. Cheers.